up you guys welcome to our channel my name is bianca and i'm juanito and together we are J &B. B. so we're so excited to film this video for you guys um today we're going to be filming our furnished apartment tour if you guys are interested in seeing how our apartment looks unfurnished i also filmed that video almost a year ago so yes we've already been in our apartment for almost a whole year we're literally like one month away from a year and I'm honestly so so blessed to just be here and have had the opportunity to be here for a whole year I'm just so so thankful we absolutely love it here and yeah without further ado let's get straight into the video um, before we get started don't forget to subscribe turn your post notifications on so that way you get notified every time we post a new video if you enjoyed this video give this video a big thumbs up leave a comment down below and let us know what other content ideas you guys have for us. And yeah, without further ado, let's get straight on into the video. Oh, oh, hello. Welcome to our home. So as soon as you guys enter, um, it greets you to our bedroom. Bed um we actually did have a bed frame from juanito's bed we had a bed frame from juanito's bed but when we moved in here we brought the bed first just because for the first night we needed to stay here um and just kind of like quick and after that one night that we stayed here we ended up finding out that the bed is so much more comfy on the floor than on the frame for some reason i don't know let me know if you guys have tried that before or if it's like a fact but for us after that, we didn't want the, want the bed frame anymore, and also I really like how it allows for the white wall to just be like free, because obviously a bed frame, depending on like how big yours is, ours was pretty tall, so it would have been hitting that frame right there. So yeah, we have our bed on the floor. It's super comfy. If you guys have trouble sleeping, try it out and let us know in the comments if it helps you, because this really helps us sleep like babies um and then here on the wall we actually have our 2024 um vision boards so that's our 2024 vision boards that's yours that one's mine and that's mine and that's juanito's and then in the middle we actually have a canvas that juanito has had for what a couple years now yeah a few years um what did you get on instagram so he got it on Instagram. If you guys are interested, um, he can maybe find the seller that he got it from. And we can leave all the links in the description box of everything that we have if you guys are interested in purchasing anything that we have. Um, and then we just have a dresser here. That dresser actually my mom gave to me. I can ask her where it's from. It might be Ikea. And then we have the collection of Juanito's books. All the books I've read. He's read all years. of them within the years. And then we just have two whiteboards with our um we write like kind of more like a another vision board kind of like we write um like i'll read you like what mine says more right? of our like random thoughts yeah so positive like for thoughts. mine i have um you can like zoom in and see but yeah like my favorite just like my favorite affirmations affirmations is what i'm trying to say so like make your dreams into reality focus you know like growth peace grateful blessed Every day be your best self, be positive, consistent, believe, manifest, have a clear vision, mindset, financial freedom, health and wealth. And then Juanito has some of his like patience and he's also a day trader. So he has like some of his um my little reminders of the like trades. for when he's trading. Yeah. yeah. Um and then oh and then I love this little pink um Himalayan lamp. I love that so much. I just feel like it makes the the room like that much cuter the vibe the vibe and then here we have this beautiful um shoe organizer that we actually got from one of our neighbors that lives here we have a bulletin board where we're all able to like upload pictures and sell things um that we want to get rid of so i actually got this from her so i don't know exactly where it's from but i just thought it looked so cute right here um in this space it's like fits perfect and then we have this little like greenery um, centerpiece with like a candle that you can turn on just to like set the mood, set the vibes. And then this painting, um, I actually painted like two days ago. Me and my family had um, 
a paint and sip night and it was just so much fun i highly recommend if you want to do any activities with your family um we just watched a youtube video that was guiding us step by step on how to uh, make the painting but yeah i mean i don't think i did too bad this is already my second time everybody was complimenting my That's mountains really cool. so yeah. yeah i just put this here here in the corner and then coming this way we just have a little mirror right here we don't use this mirror too much it's just one that we had left over from our old place that we lived at um but yeah i think it looks okay here for now and then as you can see we also have the boys <laughs> bed um this bed i got from walmart um and that centerpiece if you're interested i also got from walmart um and yeah we have this bed here because the boys do love to like jump from the bed to their bed and we don't want to have just like the hard floor whenever they do want to jump off from the bed in the middle of the night and then i love this little corner this is the boys corner we have um a little um, mat and you can see it's like the little paw prints and the bones that's so cute i got that from ross and then their water bowl um is also shaped in a bone that's so cute and i got that from amazon so yeah, i'll leave everything um, linked in the description box everything that I can find for you guys and then over here we have my little nightstand section so I got both of these I believe from Wayfair so I'll leave that link down below for you guys and then this beautiful lamp I thought looked super cute there kind of gives it like Tulum vibes um, and this lamp we also got from the same neighbor that we got the shoe organizer from and actually when my boyfriend went to go pick up those lamps um he saw like a little glimpse of their apartment and he said that their apartment also gave like tulum vibes so me and my boyfriend love tulum vibes um so we knew that it would be perfect here and then i just have this beautiful little bear that i yeah that you. my boyfriend gave me for <laughs> valentine's day like what two yeah i think two years ago um so yeah i just have it here and then just this little um Pompous, um, pompous, what do you know what I'm trying to say? <laughs> um, and then we have our, like, it's like a mini walk-in closet. It's not that big, but we made it work. Juanito didn't have too much clothes, or he also actually got rid of a lot of clothes. So shout out to him for being a supportive boyfriend. And yeah, so this is I had a closet. compromise. Yeah. But honestly, you guys, before we get in here, um... <laughs> I love this closet so much because my old closet, so like little backstory, I was living half at my mom's and half at my boyfriend's house. Um, and I didn't have, I had clothes in both places and the clothes that I did have at my mom's was actually in an outside shed. So if it was really cold, if it was raining, if it was really hot, I would literally have to go Sometimes I would shower and I would forget to get clothes, so I would have to like go out in my towel to the sh outside shed. Like yes, my mom's house was like closed off, so it was fine. But just the whole hassle of like I had to get my clothes from outside to now me having like my closet, you know. And it's like so beautiful, I love it. So when you walk in, um, I love the, you probably won't be able to see because I filled it up so much. But I love the like racks and shelving that it already came with what is it called like um, um i know it's racks and shelving but mm -hmm. like just the way that they already had the closet like racks the setup you know mm -hmm. so yeah so here i need to get rid of a lot of stuff so here i just have some jackets um long sleeves and i have like my crop tops i honestly just have a bunch of stuff here here i have uh, more of like my dresses more of my um vacation outfits and then all of this is like gym wear and then i have like more fancy dresses here puffer jacket and then here this one actually is higher than both of these so that way i was able to put all my like fancy pants here and then above um i love that you also have storage up there so i have some hats and then i have all of my shoes on the same like higher shelves and then here in the middle is my favorite. Here is where I have all my bags. Um, my bags and then yeah, some shoes. And then down here, it was available for you to put more hangers like how it is here. But I instead put some um, cubbies. So that way I can have more of like my PJs and all like my folded clothes. 
And then if you come in here, it's a little tight squeeze, but we're gonna make it happen. So if you come in here, then you also have this rack and also like more shoes. So the whole top rack is shoes. And then here I have all of like my winter jackets and um, sweaters and stuff. Um, I have more bags. And then in these two cubbies, I have more gym leggings. And then this area should have been clean. This is, this is all Juanito here. But I'm really happy with um, this little hooks that I got him from Shein, I believe. For his hats because it just keeps all his hats nice and organized and then yeah this is his section and he also has more cubbies that i'll show you guys um as we keep going on this now to the so yeah now moving part. on to yeah the best part what really sold us to this apartment was the bathroom, honestly everything. I was gonna say the bathroom, the kitchen, the fact that it's a two-story. Mm -hmm. Um, but yeah, we love the bathroom so so much. So and also you guys like the way that we decorated it, I'm like so happy with the way that everything turned out and just like all the pieces um like coming together. So yeah, so here we have our double sink vanity with the light up mirrors and it's this comes in so so handy for doing your makeup um and yeah i got these soap dispensers at ross i honestly got a lot of stuff from ross so i wish i had the links for you guys but if i am able to find um some other products on amazon or anywhere else i'll leave the link down below for you guys um so yeah i have this tray here um, with our towels just for when we like wash our face or wash our hands another little towel here all the towels I also got from Amazon these um, what are these called um, bathroom mats floor mats bathroom floor mats I also got from um, Ross and then this is I feel like the centerpiece so that vibe. makes the whole bathroom like good vibes best vibes we also found this here at our apartment. Like, I think someone was trying to throw it away, throw it out. But honestly, like, it's, like if you show them, it's brand new. Yes. It's a humongous vase. Yeah. It's a huge vase. It's pretty tall. Really tall. And it came with these already. It came with this and this. And it just looks so beautiful. Um, and then here I have um, my perfume, body spray, lotion, you know, like all my girl stuff section whatever doesn't fit in here um and i do really love that under here i'm probably not gonna show you guys because you're gonna judge me but under this one we have like our laundry detergent all our like um toilet paper and like all that bathroom stuff here and then this one i have enough room to put all my like hair stuff all my makeup stuff i do need to organize it better um maybe i'm gonna show you guys don't judge me don't before, judge me before and after don't judge me i'll do an updated <laughs> Um, video maybe with my mom because my mom is really good at organizing but also if you have any tips on how I can organize this um, space better please leave me a comment below on how I can organize this better because yeah it's not organized to the best but honestly for me it works <laughs> so yeah I just have this um, here with my jewelry all of this is makeup makeup face and hair products more lotions all of this is like travel stuff, um, like jewelry, more makeup, and then this is like more like hygiene stuff, clips, brushes. Yeah, I know it's not organized, but it works for me. Like I know where everything is. So yeah, but I know that I can organize it better. Moving on, we have our hamper for our dirty clothes that we got from also from Ross. And again, with the vibe, I feel like it just fit perfectly. So before I keep saying vibe, 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 um, I feel like our aesthetic is more like boho and a little bit modern. As we step into the living room, you're going to see that we have a little bit of modern touches to the living room. But overall, I would say we have like a boho aesthetic. But let us know in the comments what you feel like our aesthetic is. Um, and then yeah, our shower really sold us too. So um, we've always wanted like a, a, a big walk glass walk-in shower. Walk shower. 
So yeah, a better view of our walk-in walk shower. Um, and then Juanito added this shower head because it just came with like a regular shower head and you know as a girl we need like the body spray one so that we were able to like do our body showers and also like clean the the bottom like when you get all your hairs um so yeah he added that we also got that from amazon and then the shelves that are in there we also got from amazon these shelves here um and then yeah so let's keep moving okay wait so right here is another reason what sold us um, we're so lucky and blessed to have our washer and dryer in our apartment. It's just so convenient and we actually love washing and we've gotten to love putting our clothes away because it's just so easy. Washer, dryer, we have enough space to fold it here and then boom, put it away. Um, and then yeah, we just have some extra laundry detergent and like, um, toilet, paper. toilet paper. Yeah. yeah, toilet paper like stock up there. But yeah, and we really just like, they're brand new. Like I love them so much. And yeah, I'm just so, so, so happy with this. And moving on. We just exited the bathroom. And another thing that really sold us is the fact that we have a, a open floor plan. So as soon as you enter um, through our door, you can already see this hallway that leads you to our beautiful living room and just the two massive windows that bring in so much natural lighting is what really sold us. And here we're gonna start off with our kitchen first. So, oh my gosh, you guys cannot tell me, like this is such a beautiful kitchen. We love, love this white marble with like the gray veins. Um, so that's what really sold us. And just the fact that we have so much space and that it's like really big and nice and open. Um, I love all of the, um cabinets, cabinets doors cabinet doors i love how this is like sheer and then with like the gray um what are these called um panels panels yeah with like the gray panels i think that the brown with the gray and the white with gray marble like mixture i think it's such a beautiful mixture so much even that when we do have our own home i feel like i would love to design or have a house that already has this same colorway um and then yeah we just have your microwave right here i love um where it's situated and then with our stove you electric have stove electric stove it's not gas not gas you have more shelving or more cabinets here and then i love our beautiful big sink. i love our beautiful big sink with all of this beautiful marble and then um oh yeah so actually i love 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 how i decorated the kitchen um space that we have because i really wanted to bring that warmth and like boho look with all the wood so you can see um a lot of wood here i have two um cutting boards wood cutting boards all of this that you see on here i got from amazon so i'll go ahead and leave the links below um so yeah like i love my knives how it's like the wood with the black i just put this beautiful candle here because i feel like the silver and like the black went good just to give like a little pop of black and then yeah we have more um what are these called Cabinet, cabinets these are also called cabinets mm -hmm. so yeah we have more cabinets here we have um, i really want to show you guys this one is my favorite because I even am obsessed with our plates and yeah, basically our plates. So I love these cute little bowls for like yogurt or like little snacks. They're so, so freaking even cute. Ice cream. Yeah, even ice cream. And it comes like in a three and like also comes like on a, like on a. Like a little rack. Like a little, yeah. And situation. you can also, kind of like for a charcuterie board, you can also use that whole um, rack for and then yeah i just really wanted all of our dishware to be white this one i love how it has like little speckled sick speckled and then yeah our beautiful sink and then here i have um a candle warmer i really like the color as well just to give like a little bit of color to it we have our dishwasher and our air fryer 
and then here we have our pantry i'm not gonna open it because it's not organized but yeah we have two shelves so it's a pretty good amount of space to fit all of our um like dry food stuff and then here we have our beautiful island slash kitchen table that i got from wayfair i believe and i actually was using this in my office back at my mom's um my office space and when we moved in here we were looking for a kitchen table and we realized that we already had this and if you see this. it matches yeah show them the matches literally our backsplash yeah how crazy look at that and i wanted to keep the island kitchen table pretty simple so i just have um this slab my boyfriend used to work in construction so he would get like randomly slabs of marble um i just put this in the middle here and then with this beautiful pompous arrangement arrangement is the word i was trying to say earlier um pompous arrangement here in the middle just so it's not too crowded when we're here eating and then these beautiful chairs um my mom gifted to us when we moved in as our like, little move-in present and they're also from amazon and then moving here um actually moving here we have more cubby space um i felt like this space was like an awkward indent to where i wanted to fill it up and we already had this cubby um we already had these cubbies and again if you show them it matches our kitchen cabinets perfectly like it's the same exact color as these cubbies color it's, and detail yeah color and the detail it's so crazy like show them right there on top of the fridge yeah look at this that and then show them here again it's so crazy to me like little things that are meant to be like that make me so happy it like warms my heart and so yeah we already had this here it fit perfectly and all of these cubbies are Juanito's clothing. So yeah, he has enough for his clothes. Um, don't come for me in the comments saying that he only has that little section because he does also have this section here. Um, and then I just found um, these cute little like quote artwork pieces. Um, I'm pretty sure like um, at Ross or Amazon. And then just like another clear vase with like pompous. And this is a tripod that we need to start using. We haven't used this like that TikTok one that follows you. But yeah, and then another tripod here. Um, and then coming this way, I'm so in love with this area right here. Um, we got this mirror from Walmart. Um, I'll leave the exact one linked down below for you guys. We got it at Walmart and I love it so, so much. We're debating if we should mount it on the wall or not i feel like what's safer like i don't know you guys let us know like think about it we're in california and if we were to have an earthquake is it safer that it's like this or is it safer if it's mounted on the wall i don't know i feel like if we mount it on the wall of course it will look higher but also on the floor is perfectly fine because if you can see we're like, like the full body yeah we're perfectly like full body in it and just like the arch to it and at first i was looking for a gold mirror because you can see i have more like gold in here but i'm actually really happy that we stayed with the black one because since our tv is black and then we have this light strip right here that's also black i just feel like it tied in and our um what is this called our, our sound bar our sound bar and our little chimney since all of that is black if we back up and just show you the whole look of everything together i feel like the black mirror just tied everything in together and if it was gold i feel like it would have thrown it off um so yeah um we have a vase with pompous and then our 65 inch mm -hmm. tv i believe it's 65 inch 65 65 yeah. inch um and then i love how my mom my mom put the wires to the tv she covered them with these white um wire covers and i like how she did them like straight evenly in the middle of the tv because it also gives it kind of like a design um like you know like the paneling design and then um we got this beautiful fireplace um what's it called tv stand tv yeah tv stand like just, TV. we're not using it as a stand yeah but uh, i said tv console i think it's called no um living room console do you guys know what i'm saying um 
I got it in white from Amazon. I absolutely love it. It has um, LED lights. Are they on right now? Mm, they're on, but... They're on, but since it's daylight... You can't see it, yeah. But they have LED strips. We're actually going to film for you guys at night, too, so you can see the whole vibe at night with our lights that we have. Um, but yeah, it comes with these shelvings, and we just put some beautiful pictures here. Um, and these gold and like wooden picture frames the fireplace some more beautiful pictures here of us yeah and some of the boys traveling to Loom, some of the boys this little um quote here so you're gonna see we have a lot of like these little quote um canvases here and then I just have a donut vase here with some more compass. I feel like it frames the TV perfectly. Um, and then along with just a white candle here. Um, we didn't used to have this here. So it looked like that. If you back up, you can see. It looked like that. Um, I just put this gold light art piece here. And then another one of those quilt canvases. But now we actually got a furbo camera for the boys um our boys that are right here are beautiful boys um introduce you to teddy and lucky you're gonna see a lot of them in our vlogs and our videos they're our babies they're our whole world our whole life <laughs> they're the cutest babies in the whole white world right now they're being so cute and comfy because their tummies are full and they're like little twins and they're not the same breed even though they're like literally you guys can see they're like they're so alike they're like perfect together but yeah these are little babies in our living room and um oh yeah so back to the furball really quick um so this is a camera right here and um we control it through our phone and it actually follows them when they're like walking from like the living room to the kitchen or however this will detect their movement and follow them and then this little section here um it throws out treats and we control that on our phone. So I can actually show you guys right now. No, this video is not sponsored by Furbo, but once we get to that point, Furbo, if you would like to sponsor us, you can go ahead and sponsor us because we really do love this Furbo. I'm gonna go ahead and pull out um, the uh... app and show you guys. So it's an app and then, oh, <laughs> yeah, <know>. my butt, <laughs> look. My butt's in the camera, I'm dead. But yeah, basically, I'm gonna move out of the way. Okay, so, so yeah, it's a camera, and then you guys you see, see this them. little treat right here. So it throws treats. So, it, and then, so that way, when we're not home, thank God. That was not planned. Yeah. <laughs> Sometimes they don't eat them, but that actually, it threw out a perfect amount, and they each got. The perfect amount and yeah they love furbo they love their treats it's basically like a nanny cam is what they call it and yeah it's perfect for whenever we're not home and um, we want to check up on them and give them like a little treat it just gives us so much peace of mind to know like that they're okay and everything um thankfully i work from home so which we're gonna get to right now i work downstairs so this is a two-story um unit complex two-story so we're gonna head down there in a bit. We're just gonna finish up the living room right now. Um, but yeah, I love that furbo. If you guys have um, dogs or cats, I highly, highly recommend that for your animals. And just again, this is the camera, just to show you guys the camera. And then you can move it or it can follow them. I right now, I have it to where it's not following them because they actually get freaked out when the camera follows them and we're not here. So I just turned that um, feature off. But yeah, you can like move the camera around. It's like 360. And then, yeah, so let's get back into our living room. Furbo, sponsor me because I'm I'm a big advocate for you guys and I love Furbo. So, yeah, okay, here we have, um, I was carpet. looking for a perfect rug for the boys and we found this at Ross. I love the color. It matches our theme, our aesthetic. It matches our couch and everything so perfectly and the boys absolutely love it. We got it at Ross. And then we have this, um... I always forget the name of this. Um, what is it called? I'll say basket. Basket, yeah. <laughs> we have this beautiful wooden basket from Ross as well with some cozy blankets folded in. 
Um, and then we have the boys' beds. With this is their of, section. Yeah, this is basically their section right here. They own this part. They own the whole house, but this is their section. They have their two beds with some comfy blankets. And then this is their toy box. We put all their toys away right now for you guys to film. <laughs> and he's probably about to take them out, and that's okay now that we showed you guys. But yeah, yeah he probably wants his toys. He's gonna let's, start taking let's them Let's see what out. toys he's gonna get out. <laughs> Get oh, it. he wants a squeaky. Get it, buddy. He broke that squeaky from another, you know, like how the squeakies are inside of the toys. He oh, ripped it and I put it away. I put it there. Oh. Yeah. Okay. So that's our toy box. They come in here and they get their toys. More blankets for them. That's our sound. What is that? Uh, surround sound speaker. That's our surround sound speaker. And then let's show you guys our couch. So... Our couch, we actually got Ashley's, uh, me and my mom, and um, she has half of them because it comes with two other recliners. Um, don't mind my nail, I broke it, so if you see me doing this, yes, I broke it. Sorry, I didn't mean to flip you off. Um, so I took this part, she has like two, three other, two other parts of the couches at home. But it's this gray leather color, I absolutely love them, um, especially with the boys. We would want um, white. We would want those white cream cloud couches, but honestly, right now with the boys, I don't really feel like that's the best move. Once we do move into our house, then we can invest in them because I do want to get like the CB2, like you know the row ones, and they are a little bit on a higher price. I um, mean, we already have this, so it just it, it was perfect that we already had them. I have it covered with this. Blue Okay, and then I have this blanket tucked in to the couch because Mr. Lucky likes to, Mr. Lucky, that's Lucky, he likes to scratch and get comfy and he's already starting to like um, mess up the leather on that specific side. So I don't know, it probably doesn't look the cutest to me. It looks very comfy, so I don't mind it. And I love cozy blankets, so I honestly think it looks perfectly fine. Um, but we have that on there specifically for them and it's just comfy you know sometimes leather can get like sweaty and hot especially if you're wearing shorts so I think it's perfect and then I love these cream color I want you to zoom in a little bit I love like the texture to these pillows it has like a little bit of like gold glitter in it and I absolutely love that and like the cream color so we have two of these one here one at the other corner and then I love my teddy material sherpa material um pillow that I have in the middle we love um laying on that one it's so so comfy and then we just have another throw blanket here we absolutely love blankets I have an obsession for comfy blankets and so does Teddy he loves blankets um and then we actually have two chairs here for whenever we have guests over and whenever we need more seating we have two of these um great chairs behind our couches that we can just pull out and have like on the side anywhere um and then we have these are our side tables look at what teddy's doing <laughs> he's trying to get to his toys he's like so confused as to why we have his toys away because yeah. normally this whole thing is full of blankets toys and just their whole little mess i guess look at but his face look at their faces <laughs> he understands what we're saying <laughs> So yeah, he's trying to get to his toys. We never have it clean like this. I'd be lying to say if we did. I mean, we have it clean. Look, the house is clean, but they always have their stuff out. If you have kids, you know what I mean. These are, they are our kids. Okay. So these are our side tables. I could have gotten something you could say fancier, but I'm gonna be real with you. I love the wood color to it. It's literally the perfect wood color. And then it serves as a purpose as we can put them in front of us to eat and have movie nights um movie dinner nights and yeah my boyfriend has one on his side as well and then we have another one of the same lamps that we have in our bedroom um and then above here i have this beautiful beautiful canvas again i love the gray i love the gold black wood like that is just my aesthetic um, and it says have faith and we're super, super believers in having faith. So I love that there. And moving on here to our beautiful 
massive windows. We just have um, a beautiful fake plant there. I'm not sure what kind of plant that is, fake plant. We have this gold cloth that we really just use for aesthetics. Um, another little plant. And then another little sign. Life is so beautiful. My mom actually um, put that on there because it's like the ones where you could write whatever you want. Um, and then Teddy stretching. And then our beautiful, beautiful olive tree. Again, from Amazon. I feel like it just made this corner of our living room. It just tied in the whole living room, the whole look. This beautiful olive tree. Uh, maybe in the future we'll get a taller one just to make the walls and the ceilings, um, like you show off the height of the ceilings if you make it taller. Um, and then my mom actually, because of course when you buy it, it comes just like, just like this. Can you see? Like this. But my mom got like these pebbles and she um, put it in here. This is supposed to be more sunken in, but it keeps um it, higher. it keeps it rising it, it keeps rising up so we have to put more little pebbles and then i love this white um what is it called this nice. and this stand yeah i love that because again because again as you can see the wood the white it just goes perfectly and i believe that's everything in our oh no here um i don't it's love area i don't love this look of back up a little or is it 0.5 so it's not that it's good. 0.5 um yeah. I don't absolutely love how the inside of this looks. I do love how the glass cabinet looks here, but I feel like we could do better on the inside. But for right now, it works for us. We just kind of have these two cubbies here with all of our electronics, all of our paperwork, my school books, more school stuff. And then this is, a, this is fine up here. We have like more picture frames, our Bible opened right here. Um, and yeah, our like controls to our lighting and our fireplace and all of that. And then this is so insane to me. Like this plant right here means so much to me because when we moved in here, literally almost a year ago, the property gifted us this plant when we moved in. And um, I've been able to keep it alive for almost the whole year and I'm gonna continue to keep it alive. It keeps growing so beautifully. I know like the ends are a little bit, um, they look like they're dead, but no, like she's thriving. I absolutely love her. Um, and then I have another painting here. I just have it there cause I don't know where to put it. I don't like, I love it. I also painted this, but I don't love the colors because it doesn't match with our home. Um, but our property here has events and this was one of the events where they came, um, they brought a teacher to have a painting class and yeah it's just like this beautiful sunset palm tree um vibe so yeah i just have it here for now let me know where you guys like, think that i should put this um and then i can show you guys our fridge really quick just so you guys can see like the space of it it's not as organized as i would like um usually it's more organized than this when we meal prep but right now it's just kind of like all over the place all over the place but i just want you guys to see like um don't see this the shelving ah. <laughs> should i do it take a shot i'm gonna just take a shot for you guys this was not planned but i mean juanito said it's been sitting there it's been sitting here since my sister came like a couple weeks ago she left this here so let's do it let's do it for the vlog eh, eh, eh. Eh, 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 eh. <laughs> me hyping myself up <laughs> Yum. Yum. Okay. We can add that to our um, trailer. Mm -hmm. Okay. So, I love our fridge so much. I'll marry it's this. It's big. I'll yeah. marry this fridge. It doesn't like, look big, but okay. it's good space. I know I'm talking a lot, you guys, but I know people who are like me will appreciate that I'm very detailed um, with everything. So, um, that's to say that when you move into your own place you really appreciate the little things like i know you, you someone probably thinks i'm being ridiculous over a fridge but we my boyfriend and i appreciate the little things like being able to have your own fridge where you have 
your own food organized in there like you know how it is to live with other people and let's say your family eats a certain way and then you eat a certain way like for example Juanito and I we have a lot of energy drinks we have a lot of protein shakes so just the fact that we have our own space like I love this container here usually we have it really organized so here we have all of our like zero sugar sodas we usually have all of this like protein shakes meal preps meal preps meal preps and that's then, not meal prep no i said usually <laughs> i know i know but i'm just yeah, saying yeah yeah this is yesterday um but it's not that bad it's not, honestly not that bad yeah. this is the boys food this is our food actually our meal prep just ground beef and we eat it with like rice and um veggies up here and honestly it's not that bad now that i'm looking at it we i know look at water, our, yo I mean, our yogurts our yogurts so cottage cheese um eggs. our eggs these eggs need to go up there and this shelf is usually all of our um, rain or energy drinks. Um, sauces, our milk, blah, blah. You guys get the deal. But I'm just so happy to have our own fridge. And yeah, it's all like the little things. So that's our fridge. And then down here is the freezer. And yeah, so we just have all of our like stuff here. You need to try these from Costco if you guys haven't tried these already. They're fire. They're so fire. They're the Bibigo. I don't know if I'm saying that right. But the Bibigo, I'll insert a picture of what the box looks Chicken like here. Chicken teriyaki bowls. Chicken teriyaki bowls. These are so fire when you need a quick meal, um, a quick, healthy, high protein meal. You just pop it in the microwave for about five minutes and literally teriyaki chicken with rice, with veggies. It's so, so good. We love having these. For whenever we're on the go or like just don't have time um and yeah i believe that's everything upstairs, upstairs. Mm -hmm. so i'm gonna put my shoes on because these are my slippers that i wear i love these slippers uh oh ah, we have a situation oh. over here come on daddy and we love how much space we have and the boys yeah. The boys love this space. The boys love it. I'm telling you guys, when we used to live before, it was just, I had one room at my mom's house and one room at his mom's house and we were back and forth. So the boys were always just in a little room. Mm -hmm. That's it. So now they have their big space. I'm so happy. We love it. But yeah, let me put my shoes on because these are the shoes I wear just upstairs because we have, we don't wear shoes up um, inside. But downstairs is my, um, work studio so i do lashes if you guys didn't know i'll leave my instagram and all of my socials for my lash business i'll leave them here or i'll leave them down below if you guys are in the los angeles county area i won't say exactly where for privacy reasons but if you guys ever wanted to get your lashes done or take a lash training with me i'll go ahead and leave all my information there um so yeah i'm gonna put my shoes on and then we're gonna head down to tell you how we have that Shout out to my mom because honestly, I love it the way that it's organized. My mom had this, you can come closer so you can see, I'm not sure you can see. It's like a dresser. Yeah, this dresser and inside we have cubbies and a rack for our shoes. So we have more shoe space and more cubbies with the boy stuff. This is also more cubbies with um, like the boy stuff. Here we have some hooks for our like outside jackets and stuff like rain jackets. And then we also use it for, look at my mom, dude. Look at how my mom um, organized right here. She put these, I'm not sure what they're called, but for our like um, broom, mop, Swiffer, all of that, just to keep it nice and organized. And just like another light that we use for um, videos. This is Juanito's old vision um, board slash whiteboard. And yeah, I don't want to get rid of it. So we just have it there because I really love um, it came a long way with us, so we just like to have it there. But yeah, I'm gonna put my shoes on, and then we're gonna head downstairs. Go. Ta -da! So this is my lash studio. I absolutely love how I'm able to work from home, but still have it completely separate from our home. So we're gonna go super into detail down here as well, just because I love the way I decorated here. Turn on the lights. Mm -hmm. It's not that one, it's the other one. Okay. Um, 
So down here, we also have these, down here it's actually floor to almost ceiling windows, um, as you can see. And it just, it's just so, so such beautiful. A vibe. Like it's such a vibe. It's literally like my dream space, my dream. Like look how tall they are as you're standing there. Yeah. I know, look at that. Yeah, it's just so, so beautiful. And yeah, this is my Lash studio. Um, honestly, I'm not gonna go into detail. I said I was, I'll show you guys everything. But if you guys want me to go in detail, um, like on where I got everything, because I feel like this is more for lash artists or people who are um, aspiring to be lash artists. Not everyone else is gonna wanna have a lash bed and a lash light. So comment down below if you guys want a separate video of me going into detail on where I got everything. Um, but yeah, we'll just show you like an overview of my space. Again, with the boho theme, the beige, the textures, my neon sign, my little area, sit down area. Um, and yeah, I just absolutely love it. And I'm just so blessed and happy with this space. Um, and oh yeah, and then we also have another bathroom down here. So I'll go ahead and show you guys. Um, so it's two story, one bedroom with like a loft. Um, I already said two bathroom, right? Two bathroom. Two bathroom. And we have two entrances. So, so two bathroom, two story, one bedroom, and like a humongous loft down here. I do host, I host last training. So I need a really big space for me to be able to um, train and teach. So yeah, this is absolutely perfect for me. Um, and then I'll go ahead and show you our bathroom that we have down here. And we also have two entrances. So the entrance that we showed you from upstairs, and then we have a separate entrance for my clients and my students to enter through here. So they don't even have to enter through our um, space upstairs. So taking you guys into the bathroom here. Turning on the lights for you guys. So again, I'm absolutely in love with this lit up mirror, um, this white floating um, vanity, mm -hmm. no, not vanity, um, sink, yeah, floating sink. sink. And I just have this beautiful plant right here and you know, just the basics. So, you know, everything, candle warmer. But let me go ahead and turn on this for you guys. Boom. I'll show you guys my beautiful wall. It says, do what you love. I absolutely love it. I love the vibes in the bathroom. I always get so many compliments. Um, and then we do have a shower in here too. So it's a full, um, are you on point five? Yeah. It's a full bathroom. We, of course my clients and students don't use this. My boyfriend and I don't use this either. But whenever I have guests over, did you show them this? Oh, my God. This one. So yeah. So that's our bathroom. When we have guests over. Yeah, a pretty good bathroom space down here. So when I have guests over, I actually have um, like a blow up. I either have a blow up mattress or like, um, what are they called? Like little cods, like the ones that we use to go camping. I have that and well, actually my mom bought them, but um, we use those whenever we have guests over and then they can sleep down here and shower down here. Basically they have like a whole apartment down here to themselves whenever I have guests over, like my family, my mom, all that type of stuff. Um, and then yeah, I have another little area here where I just have more of um, um, beautiful decor. And under here, underneath the stairs, it actually comes in so clutch because underneath the stairs, um, we use that storage. There's like a pretty big space underneath the whole stairs. Um, and yeah, it's just perfect for extra storage. And yeah, so um, show them like the staircase that leads up to our apartment as well. Did you show them like a view from down there up? Yeah. I did. And you showed a good view of like this? Mm hmm. The whole space. You sure? Yeah. Okay. So, um, okay, and I just wanted to show you guys how it looks when we have our blinds down. It's also a vibe with these down. I love the cream color to it. It just matches everything perfectly. And 
Ta -da. Like honestly, I love how they look down. Also downstairs, I love how they look down. It's nice to have a little switch up of a different vibe if you want natural light or if you want more privacy. I feel like with them down, it's more like calm, peaceful vibes. And then with them up, it's like more like, I don't know, the sun makes you happy and you know, brings in some warmth. Um, so now you guys, so now you guys, we're gonna go ahead and take you guys to all of the amenities here at our complex. Um, so we have a movie room, we have a clubhouse, we have a terrace, a rooftop terrace, we have um, our pool area, clubhouse, our gym, we have our home gym. So we're gonna go ahead and just show you guys all of our amenities here. And if I'm not talking or we're not talking, in those it's just for privacy reasons of other people that are there if there's some people there and music and music because um as soon as we step out like in the hallways everywhere in the complex they do play music and we don't want to get copyright so we might just like write little um text in it but from now on it's just gonna be more like montage style we're just gonna go ahead and show you all of the amenities if i could talk i will and then if not yeah we'll just go ahead and write little text if needed um but yeah let's get on to the rest of the tour Little walkway. I'm gonna talk but not so loud because we do have like all the complexes here. I don't want people to hear me like screaming. But we have this little walkway and this is actually on our floor. Um like where our unit is. We have this beautiful walkway here with seating areas and there's so many beautiful plants and greenery. We have um this little waterfall over here. The boys love coming here, and I don't know, it's like the sound of it is so peaceful. And we'll be walking this way. Right it's super like jungly here. It's cool. So here we have another grill with a humongous 
island. The texture on this one's sick. We can even come eat here for our mukbangs. Oh yeah. We have so many areas where we can do videos for you guys. So leave video ideas down in the description, not in the description box. Comment. In the comment section. Um, any video ideas you guys have for us. And we'll gladly film those for you guys. Like I even have a fridge here. So you can like store your meat, your drinks, grill your food, have a little carne asada, a little barbecue. And then you have seating for four here. So it's good for like a little small get together. Um, and then we have a little fireplace down this way. Can you see the pop part from here so we don't have to actually go? Kinda. Zoom in or no? Yeah. Or when we're leaving to in and out, you want to get off real quick and just record it. Mm -hmm. Yeah? Yeah. Alright guys, so that's gonna conclude our furnished apartment tour. I really hope that you guys enjoyed watching this video. Before you leave, don't forget to subscribe and turn on your post notifications so that way you get notified every time we post a new video. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a big thumbs up. Leave a comment below of what other videos you guys would like to see us film together. We have a lot of video ideas in mind. So we would love if you guys share some ideas with us. And yeah, I really hope you guys enjoyed. Thank you for everyone um, who stayed to the end of this video. We really appreciate it. And we'll see you guys in our next video. Bye.